Hey everyone, this is Hammer Bro Mike, and welcome back to the Wind Waker HD. Last episode, we got um, we got the ice arrows, we got the iron boots, got some more treasure charts and stuff, and we learned something interesting about uh, Tetra. So now we are going back to this island over here because we need to get an arrow upgrade which I mentioned in said episode so this episode it's gonna be a bit of a random one basically just getting random stuff uh, basically whatever comes to mind <laughs> really um, yeah so before we go in there we're gonna see what this is about good morning one letter for Jay what is it? I bet it's from Arrow. Yep, it's from Arrow. Mr. Gonzo is a really big guy, but ever since Miss Tetra left, he's been crying like a baby. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you could probably pause just to read if you want. Good luck, Arrow. Aw, oh, she's so nice, giving me rupees. I mean, I... Well, actually, that's good, even though I'm about to get magic and everything reborn here. So, you know what? Let's get this out. Because we can get more fairies. Well, A. Another fairy. <laughs> Young Waker of the Winds, allow me to aid you in your quest. Did I mention I also look like a character from Skyward Sword? Kinda. Even though, yeah, never mind. Yay! We can now carry up to 60 arrows. So there's one more, we, one more arrow upgrade we can get. Which, you know, we we might as well get this episode. And then, if if I am correct, then we've gotten every great fairy upgrade in the game which I think is pretty good <laughs> okay so let's see here let's check my map so we can go to thorned fairy island for that let's do that though so we could go to that lookout platform but I don't want to do that yet all right I, or I can continue swimming under the boat Alright, so what we're going to do here is we're going to warp to the Tower of Gods, we're going to go to Thorned Fairy Island, and then we're going to go to one of the Archipelago Islands, so we can try to get one more gold feather so we can give them to the Rito guy, and so he can give them to his girlfriend. Alright, we are going this way. Alright, what are we dealing with here? So, we're going to be passing by Eastern Triangle Island, and we're going to be going to Thorn Fairy Island. Now, what do we got here? Ooh. Yeah, um, saving another picture, which is of a, um, um, e -er -er -er. It's of uh, a floor master, so we might as well get that. All right. Um, let's see here. So we okay. So we're gonna go east, and then we're gonna go north to Star Belt Archipelago, because we want. Uh, we need one more gold feather, and then we can go to Dragon Roost once more. Because going to Dragon Roost is fun. And I think that should be the last thing to do at Dragon Roost, actually. Unless there's any more Rito that I have to get pictographs for. Which I do not know at the moment. But we are going to go to Thorned Fairy Island here. And press those three Butos. Switches. Thingies that are sticking out of ground. To get those thorns, those, you know, those things removed. 
come on. Okay, I'm... Uh, did I get... Did I do this? No, I did not. <laughs> so now we got 10 of those. And we need 15 more. And where all of those are is beyond me. Again, I, ha I still have to look into where all the blue chew jelly is. Because apparently getting all 23 is... Actually, no, we only need 13 more. But yeah, we need 15 to be able to get blue potions at Windfall Island. So what... So I think before we go to Windfall Island, I'm going to try to figure out where to get five more of them. Oh yeah, we can carry 99 now. <laughs> 99 arrows. And we're good. Okay, now... So, we are going to go north. And where are you, red lions of the... <laughs> I love when you get close to these ships, they just... They just look the other way. Alright, let's go this way. And we gotta look at a platform here. A lot of these, you'll, no you'll normally find look at platforms at islands that um, don't really have anything like they don't have much of anything so like the Great Fairy Island there's not much of anything so look at platforms these this archipelago over here which is just things sticking out of the water there's gonna be lookout platforms nearby see you right there well at least one anyway so we need one more feather and then we'll go to Dragon Roost Um, don't need that. Okay, give me the feather. You gave me nothing. Alright, we got, we have two more here. Actually, three more. Come on. Really, a ruby? I was not expecting it to get that close. Alright, good. Alright, we're good. Let me just confirm. Darn it. Alright. Start of our spoils adventure. We are going to Dragon Roost. I'm gonna hand in those 20, and then we are gonna be getting something good in the mail soon. It's good to be getting these out of the way. But before we do that, let's get this tingle bottle. Bottling the tingle. Tingle the bottle. I like the tingle bottles. They are fun. Let's get this one while we're at it. I don't know, I think the Tingle Bottles just, like, add a whole new layer of fun to this game. Even though I really miss using the Tingle Tuner. But I think it's fine. Which we also need two more Tingle Statues, which we get from the Earth Temple and Wind Temple. Uh, eh, never mind. I thought maybe we'd get something good. Um... Yeah, I've already got a bunch of the read too. Here we go. She wants a gold feather. 20. Yes, I am. Yay. Orange rupee. That helps. So we get an orange rupee, but then we'll get a letter in the mail from his girlfriend, I believe. So, yep, that's... All we have to do here, well actually we do have to come back for story reasons later, but other than that I think we're good for now. Uh, might as well get the other one here. There we go. On to whatever is next that we can do. What else can we do actually? Um, well we could go back to Outset Island, but I want to dedicate an episode for what I want to do there. You know what? 
Fire Mountain. <laughs> we have to get the treasure here with the fire, with the ice arrows. So let's go. Get some ice action going on here. So we, because we're at, we actually need, um, we can act, we're actually able to get some sort of treasure here. Oh, or, well, not exactly the treasure I was talking about, but. I mean, this works. Uh, did I get it? There we go. <laughs> I thought I was going to have to pull out the map. We've been doing really good with finding these treasures lately. Good thing for having a large amount of treasure charts. And now we can buy that piece of heart. <laughs> but we'll do. maybe we'll do that after this. Oh yeah, we got to freeze up here. You know, I could have come here to get the gold feather. Oh, well. The things you learn later. But now we can explore, get the treasure here. Come on, let me... No. Why aren't I climbing up? Okay, that's weird. Um. Yeah, so this island, we just climb up to the top but we gotta do it over here but th this one's really this one's a little more simple I think I mean it's tough but because you gotta climb to the top and everything I'm, I can't, don't remember if there's anything else on the out that that feather is taunting me right now um, I believe it's this way. Yeah. Fire Mountain. We are conquering you. Aw, oh, man. Though I do like these segments. Yeah. Let's get across to the other side. Yeah. Come on. There we go. No! I am all kinds of upset right now. This game. I love it. <laughs> I was going to say, I hate this game! But no, I, it's, I love it. I love The Wind Waker. It's one of my favorite games. Favorite Zeldas? It's probably my third favorite. Though it's my... Console Zelda-wise, it's my second favorite. But... As a whole, it's definitely my third favorite. Alright. I could just Deku Leaf this, but whatever. Okay, I'm not gonna fool around this time. I'm gonna do what I gotta do. I gotta do, gotta do, gotta do. Alright. Alright. It's better to go a little bit slowly. I'm actually having a lot of fun playing this game on the channel again. I wish I... Honestly, I wish I could have done it before, but I'm I'm happy that I'm able to do it again right now. Oh, I thought it was going to be set on fire. I was thinking of, uh, what's that game? Uh, Triforce Heroes. I think if, like, the keys are on fire, then you can't do anything about it. Okay, so I... Come on. Yeah, well, that works. I think you just have to beat these two. For the treasure to appear. Yep. So this island, pretty easy. Not much to it. But, hmm, that thing's in the way. What do I need to get past there? Probably some sort of, you know... Power bracelets, yeah. So power bracelets basically make it so you can pick up heavy objects like that one, which pretty sure that's the only heavy object that you pick, <laughs> the type of bleh, type of heavy object that you pick up in this game. So now that we have that, we actually have there's actually a cup. Well, there's a couple things we can do, but. When we go back to Outset Island, 
We can use them there. We can use them at Stonewatcher Island. But we are going to go back to Rock Spire Isle because we can buy that piece of heart now with the amount of rupees that we have, which is good. Getting them rupees is real good, yeah. So yeah, I think um, at this point right now, Twilight Princess HD comes out next Friday, which is a week from right now for me, as of the recording of this episode, which I'm looking forward to Twilight Princess HD, and I'm actually pondering whether or not I should play it, play the game for the channel, do a let's play, you know? I've been thinking about it, and I think it would be a lot of fun, because, but at the same time, it's like I don't want to do like a whole bunch of Zelda stuff on this channel, despite loving Zelda so much, because I feel like if I do one Zelda, I'm going to want to do another and another, and I'm just, that's all this channel is going to be is a Zelda channel, <laughs> but I mean, there's nothing too wrong with that, but I, I, you know, Twilight Princess is one of those games that uh, for me, it's it's one of the first games that I really started looking into once like that time came when it was coming out. Yay! Oh, oh, we only had two before. Okay, never mind. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. You're clearly Beetle Masked Man of the Masked Man variety. So we got a piece of heart, and we only need one more to get 12 hearts. Can I just climb? Thank you. All right, let's check out our maps, even though you can't see. All right, that's submarine map. Platform, okay. Incredible chart. Um, we still got a bunch of stuff to do with that yet. Um, okay. Actually, okay, I'm going to make... I am going to go to Windfall Island for... Actually, no. Um, you know, we still have... Okay, I'm, I'm all over the place with this episode. I'm really sorry. But we are going to go to Spectacle Island. Um, I believe we've already been here before to... I think we got a piece of heart already. I don't remember. But if you play the canon game again, you get a treasure chart. So we are going to do that. But unfortunately, I only have enough rupees for three tries. So we'll see how that goes, I guess. Unless I'm blessed with a... With a... No. But maybe... I got a treasure chart for this island. Ooh. I wonder what that could be for. Good thing I came here. <laughs> so we're going to check. I believe that's probably... Oh. Okay. Well, I got that. <laughs> so now we just need four more. Alright. Good morning! We've been seeing this thing. Well, these mailboxes quite a bit. Yep. Well, yay, now we got, all right, well, that happened a lot faster than I was expecting, but we now have 12 hearts, which means we need uh, still a number of heart pieces, but two of our upcoming hearts will be heart containers, so I guess we need 24 more heart pieces, pieces of heart. Alright, let's do this. We're gonna do some canon minigame. Yep. I have a feeling I have not done this at all yet. Okay, looks like we are doing this. Um, so basically, we have ten tries to sync these. And I did not expect to get that first one right away. So you move the control stick, whoa, um, I'm doing good here. 
So you move the control stick up and down to change the angle of which the cannonballs... A am I just, like... D am I using hacks or something? Okay, never mind. I'm not using hacks. Um, good. I was not expecting to do this good. When I, when I play on my own, I'm doing terrible. I only missed one. That is incredible. All right, I'm. I don't remember what I got here. I want to remember it over here. Yeah, I like you. <laughs> well, looks like we're doing it again, <laughs> and we got a piece of heart. Man, we're doing good. Yeah, you want to? Yeah. All right. Well, we only got two tries anyway, so we might as well make the make use. Luckily, these ones are pretty close, except for this one. That was too high. Maybe 38. Nope. Maybe 33. There we go. This one looks like it's a 23. Nope. Maybe it's 18. Come on. There we go. These ones are a little closer, so it might... It, it'll be a bit easier to judge how far they are. But we only got... Oh, four more now. All right. Um, I'm thinking 21. Yeah. Why is it that like I play on my own and I'm I am I am not good at this, but when I play for the internet, I'm doing good. Whatever. <laughs> Wait a second, miss, miss. What do you want? Do you know how to keep quiet, you scooby dog? Yeah, I have. Like, Salvatore is creepy sometimes. But I, I, I like the idea of just, like, he uses these cutouts. Alright, so we have finished this island a lot faster than I was expecting. Actually, you know what? Since we are here, I might as well. Do a little photography, if you know what I mean. So let's get this bad boy back out. Funny how- It's a good thing I thought of doing this now, rather than later. But, whatever. Okay, take a picture. That's good. Now let's check out these tingle bottles. Maybe there's something new here. Nope, that's... Of that. That's of that. Man, I forgot to get the... I forgot to get a selfie with Tetra. Man. Oh, well. Okay. Let us go. Okay. Alright, we got treasure charts up the wazoo. But I'm probably gonna dedic dedicate a, an, an episode just for getting treasures. So, that's going to be a thing. But for right now, we are not going to do that. Wait, what one is that? That's a fairy island, which I do not know which one that is. Okay. We got a... We, let's see what we can do. Let's look at the map. Get an idea here. Um, hmm. What can we do? Hmm. Let's go to Windfall Island. Not doing anything Windfall Island-ish right now. Like, I'm not gonna start the Windfall Island episodes yet. But I do want to get something started for the... Um, I want to get something started for the trading sequence. And in order to do that, we need to... Um... We need to get the uh, the town flower thing. So now around Windfall Island, we see these little pedestal things here, which we can plant various objects. But in order to do that, we need to buy this flower here. Okay, I guess we'll uh, talk over here. Yes, yes, you're the mother who purchased my sale. But I hate to say my poor little stall is not an instant success. In fact, it is rather deserted, I'm afraid to say. 
So, if only I could get, could stock rare items that people can't get here in town. Then I would make plenty of money. Yeah, you make all that money with your creepy face. So let's buy this flower over here. Um, okay. Yes. Okay. Yeah, a general store that is going to sell various new products. Contract negotiations, merchants oath, and you know the the you know the usual stuff. Yes, I perfectly understand. Even though I'm pressing the oh, okay, I don't have to buy it. All right, we got the town flower. So we got to trade the town flower. So I'm gonna. So we're gonna do an episode dedicated to trading that stuff, which. You know, I could probably do next episode, but I don't. I only have so much time to record, and I'm hoping to record one more episode, and I don't really want to go back and forth when I don't have nearly enough time. But I wanted to get that one item right now, just to get it out of the way. Okay, I'm, I'm a little all over the place right now, so I don't exactly know what I'm going to be doing next. Actually, I think next time we're going to go back to Horseshoe Island, maybe. So let's go back to Outset Island. Horseshoe Island is west of Outset Island. Um, I honestly... I, I know that we got a treasure, but I don't remember if we... Because you can get two treasure things there, but I don't remember if we got more than that. Because there's two chests, one in a secret cave, and actually, no. You know what? We're going to make this an extra long one. I'm just going to sail over here and check, because why not? Um, we can't go to Diamond Steppe Island yet, because we need the hookshot. Oops, I spoiled an item. <laughs> but yeah, I want to check. There's, there's actually a treasure here to get anyway, so we might as well get it. Um, ooh, lookouts. Um, yeah, I don't, I'm pretty sure, I don't remember if I got, because there's two, I'm all over the place, because there's a chest, did I open that chest? I don't know. I don't want that, I want that. Good. We got more treasure. Okay, so we're gonna quickly check... Um... I don't... Uh, I don't remember if I got... What's... Did I open that chest? I can't tell. Okay, I did open that chest. So I assume I did go into that... Gr that grotto there. I'm pretty sure I did. Alright, well... Um... Okay. Um, you know... Hey, sir. Sir, you're... There. Okay. Next episode, we're going to go to Outset Island or somewhere else. We're gonna do something. Next time on the Wind Waker HD. See ya.